Weatherbug.com meteorologist Addison Green here with your latest forecast, which is brought to you by Hall's Cough Drops. Stock up today at your nearest retailer. Definitely want to keep those handy during this time of the year. And as you look up across the Northeast, this time of the year has been seen this year getting plagued by snow. Most recently over across from this weekend, we had a deal of snow and Sunday River Ski Resort. The skiers, the snowboarders, they were definitely loving that site. And we will be keeping an eye on perhaps more of the Northeast and the Great Lakes to get lake effect snow coming our way throughout the day today and towards tomorrow. There's a change in temperatures going on. We're finally replacing some of that frigid Arctic air with some milder air. And it's coming from the south, which is rather sunny going in towards today and tomorrow. Satellite and radar imagery, you can see those lake effect snow bands starting to come in down towards just south and west of Syracuse, south of Buffalo. That snowstorm from the weekend is pulling away. We'll be having one, two, and another. Three clipper systems are going to be coming throughout the northern section of the country, swinging on down, bringing some light snow along the way, and then swing up in towards the northeast. However, once they get to the northeast, they're going to be having a little bit more moisture to work with off of the ocean, and they'll be bringing us around some higher amounts of snowfall totals in some spots. Maybe just a little bit of rain towards New York City. Miami may pick up half an inch. Seattle, nearly a third of an inch of rain. And then the chance for snow as we look out towards portions of the Great Lakes. Some people could see one, two, three, four inches. And then just over here and across the New England area, there's a possibility of getting about three to six inches of snow before all is said and done. That's where the cold air is. Temperatures below average. Meanwhile, check out Denver, way above average, 23 degrees warmer. New York City has 29 degrees, but at least it's sunny. Clouds are in Buffalo, scattered snow showers, high of 18 degrees. Oklahoma City, sunny 64. Brownsville goes up to 71. Meanwhile, Miami, you had a record-breaking day yesterday. Now you have temperatures into the upper 70s. And in the northwestern corner, temperatures in Jackson Hole are sitting in around 21 degrees.